Hi, if you have a new version of OpenTX, version 1, uh, version 2.1 and newer, uh, probably your telemetry sensors stop working. Uh, so I have one uh, video tutorial about setting of uh, current sensors. So this video will be about uh, setup of OpenTX with uh, right function of current sensor 40 amps in OpenTX firmware version 2.1 and newer. So about physically connections of uh, telemetry sensor same like uh, like uh, with older versions so just connect this cable with servo connectors on one from these two connectors on uh, on sensor it's not matter which you select because a second connector is just for second cable for next sensor for example for Vario. Yes, so you can connect money sensors in in chain, and all sensors will be connected connected with one servo connector on X series receiver X six R X eight R or X four R. Uh, of course, in in connector with sign smart port in X8 or XR connectors this uh, receivers oh, too close yes in X series receivers this connector is here uh, up uh, antennas so, connect your current sensor to, to receiver with right uh, wires orientation of course <coughs> and current sensor connect to uh, speed regulator and to battery. In normal use you have just this uh, sensor in your airplane connected to speed regulator and if you want to fly you just connect your battery not to speed regulator but to sensor I think it's clear uh, so I will show you a basic setup only basic functions of uh, this current sensor, so voltage, current, and the most usable uh, telemeter, uh, telemetry parameter, power con consumption. I think it's really nice function of telemetry, and uh, I use it uh, almost on all airplanes, my RC airplanes. So I will connect this now to one older F16 EDF F16 and I will show you on Taranis E only basic setup with new telemetry in OpenTX 2.1 and newer you can set many new options but this will be only about uh, basic functions. For example, you can use two current sensors. If you have a model with two uh, motors, two speed regulators and two main battery, you can use two sensors and both two sensors you can uh, use like telemetry sensor and you can uh, read power consumption of both battery. Only you must uh, change ID of sensor 
each separately so I think it's clear you must have on both sensors different ID so I will show you this on Teranis E on standard Teranis it's absolutely same but for me it's much easier with this roller uh, change of values so I will show you on this so my speed regulator is connected to receiver let's go Welcome how, to open TX. how set up switch warning I will create a new model RF signal low without yes okay first step every time uh, safe switch safe switch for motor se se down minus 100 This will be only basic function, basic basic functions, basic setup. If you want more, if you want know more, just look on manual on OpenTX. So check it. Okay, okay, okay. But I have connected in on channel one. Yes, I have wrong ID. Yes, it works. Fine. So, point number one. In new versions of OpenTX, you can see only values which are uh, in, in, in work, in progress. So, if you, for example, have not connected a vario, variometer, you cannot see altitude or vertical speed, for example. If you have not connected current sensor, you cannot see uh, VFAS, voltage and current, yes, etc, etc. If you want, just, if you want to make with some values from telemetry sensor, you must have this telemetry sensors connected and right uh, just uh, set up with right setup in uh, OpenTX. So how you can add new sensor? Just go in a telemetry screen 13 of 13 and here you have option discover new sensor. Press it and here I can see current and VFAST. These two uh, values are coming from uh, our current sensor. Next are coming from receiver. Voltage of receiver, uh, RX battery, uh, strength of connection, etc. So for us is interesting first two lines, current and VFAS. It means voltage in a, this current sensor. Here I can see ID of this sensor. You can see IDs are same for both lines. It means this uh, two lines are coming from one sensor. Yes. What is in, uh, uh, what is important after this discovery after finding of new sensors? Press it again for stop discovery. Yes. Now I will create a new sensor for power consumption because current sensor sent to Taranis only current and VFAS, but not power con consumption. Power consumption must count Taranis from current, from current sensor, and from time. 
Yes. So we will create a new sensor which will count this. So add a new sensor. Here you must set a new name and this name must be unique. Yes. For example, uh, P W as power. CN as consumption. For example, it's your choice this name, but this name must be unique. Type calculated formula consumption sensor. Here we, we here we will use a current sensor or current value from our current sensor. So just select cure and here if I have if I want lock uh, on SD card this sensor this power consumption just mark it. That's all. Now I can see we create a number a new uh, telemetry sensor number six power consumption this unique name and power consumption now is zero milliamp hours, but I can really change it because this is live. Here you can see this number is changing. So now I will create a switch, for example, this switch, and if I will press this switch, uh, Teranis tell me. Uh, just power consumption. Go on special function. We, we will create a new function with this switch. And function will be not override but but uh, here play value play value and here we will find a new sensor which we will create power uh, consumption PW or I don't know now right name just it will be here it's four numbers next 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 here current they are uh, values from current sensor current minus current plus V fast voltage as we are RX battery here power consumption this is our unique name and here 2 MAH 2 MA MAH 2 milliamp hours 2 MAH yes uh, now I will create a new function for example I want uh, that uh, radio radio will tell me if power consumption will be on some level. For example, I know that uh, I want discharge from my battery 1000 milliamp hours. So how I can create it? We must uh, create a new logical switches, a logical switch here. When a function, my recommendation is a bigger than X because this is exact value and this exact value sometime uh, cannot be uh, in radio because uh, sensors send values in Taranis with some uh, in some steps and for example if I will use a value 1000 mh uh, Sensor can send value uh, 998 and next in the next step it will be 1005 for example. But exact value 1000 will not be sent to Tyrannis. Next option is A almost, <laughs> uh, is not so precise like uh, previous parameter but my recommendation I use it is 
a bigger than x it works without really any problems so where a will be uh, power consumption so find our switch with unique name uh, switch uh, sensor here power consumption cons consumption this is a and x x is value so here you will set 1000 but of course uh, I won't show you how it works so I have now discharged 2 mAh 2 mAh so I will set only 5 milliamp hours it means if a power consumption will be bigger than x it means 5 milliamp hours switch L1 will be on logical switch L1 so bigger than 5 what is bigger than 5? 6 so if power consumption will be 6 mAh and more L1 will be on and just L1 will make same function like this switch just it will it will play uh, power consumption I think it's clear but I must change this as a as H on L1 2 MAH 2 MAH this so L1 if switch L1 will be on play value power consumption one time so I will make next thing I will set I will set a power consumption on telemetry screen for example power consumption current current and current plus it means maximum current which will be between two resets of telemetry and this screen one is just telemetry screen yes power consumption current current and current maximum current which was between two uh, resets of telemetry so now I will throttle up and after power consumption will be more than five it means six and more Taranis uh, will tell me uh, power, value of power consumption I hope you listen it so I think that's all what is important if you want use telemetry values you must have telemetry sensors connected under voltage uh, connected to receiver and you must make right discover new sensors so I hope it can help you, thanks for watching and have a nice day.